Welcome to the Griffin Real Estate Market Update. I'm Danny Griffin. If you're thinking about buying or selling residential property now or in the near future, it's very important to stay up with the local market trends. Now, according to MLS PIN, the marketplace for Boston residential properties, here's what happened in the second quarter of 2022 versus the second quarter of 2021. The number of sold listings decreased by 12% to 641 properties with a top sale of $14.8 million, located at 17 Louisburg Square in Beacon Hill. The average sale price increased by 12% to $1.6 million, and the average price per square foot increased by 6% to $1,158 per square foot. The inventory of properties available for sale as measured in month's supply, decreased by 20% to 4.11 months worth of properties for sale. The average 30-year fixed rate mortgage rate increased by 85% to an average rate of 5.85% according to bankrate.com. Now, the market is showing some signs of a cooldown. However, there is no current indication of a severe correction, including an uptick of 0.7% in the National Pending Home Sale Index, meaning all of the properties nationally that went under agreement, there was actually an increase this month, ending a six-month decrease. So there are signs of a steadying and regular marketplace where there's some balance, but no indication yet of a severe correction. But it's very important to watch what happens going into the summer months as the rise in the interest rate environment continues to have an effect on inventory and pricing. Of course, if you're thinking about buying or selling residential property now or in the near future, it's very important in this type of a market to seek the help of a professional real estate agent. And of course, we'll be back in the next Griffin Real Estate Market Update to help you keep up to date. Thanks for tuning in.